have quite a few items that are no longer wish list items or items that I'm looking for. And if you want to hear what those items are, then stay tuned. Hello, my name is Andrea. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And thanks for joining me in the Babe Cave today. And today is a tag video that was done quite a few weeks ago. And this is Danny O tagged me. This tag was created by Rami Rafi and I will link both their videos down below. To do this video of unwish list. Instead of a wish list, these are things that you just don't want to purchase anymore or were on your wish list and now they're not on your wish list because you've tried them and you're like, nah. <laughs> so I have several that are no longer on my wish list, not gonna be buying anymore. So let's get started with the first one. The first one for me is expensive card holders. I'm okay with, you know, contemporary card holders, but honestly, I don't even use the card holders that much anymore. So to spend money on a luxury brand, and if, if a color comes right, I might buy another contemporary brand, but honestly, I don't use card hold holders anymore. So these will probably be off the wish list is the full size luxury <laughs> or contemporary full size wallets. Now, I'm never going to get rid of this because it works perfectly in my Speedy 30 multicolor. And I paid probably way too much for this because I hardly ever use it. <laughs> but it's still beautiful. I love the hot pink interior, all of those. I like that it has all the card slots, you can put your coins, but the size, I just, I'm not into this size of wallet anymore. So definitely no full size wallets. The next item would be Dooney and Burke large framed kiss locks. I have it in a wine color. I have it in a crew, I have it in multicolor, and this is elephant. Now these are handy, okay, to put your cards or some essentials inside. I'll show you the inside, it has card slots. You could put chapstick or your keys or something in it. But I have four of them and I don't reach for these enough to say I need another one. <laughs> so these are no longer on my wish list. This is the six key ring holder from Louis Vuitton. We've all seen these. I'll open it up if you haven't. <laughs> and it has a little spot for your cards. Now, I do not want any more key holders because all I do is throw in uh, my car key in the bottom of my bag and don't touch it. I don't use a house key because we have a garage and I go in the garage door. <laughs> so there will be no more key holders. <laughs> I, <clears throat> I understand some people like to protect the inside of their bags, but honestly, I don't get my keys out to even worry about it. Now I'm going to use this cause well, I have it, <laughs> but I will no longer be buying any key holder SLGs again. <laughs> this next one is costume jewelry and these are from Coach. I'm not going to say that these were ever on my wish list, but they tarnish pretty easily. It's just costume jewelry. These are the huggy earrings and I wear them occasionally, but 
to me, I just don't feel like I need any more costume jewelry. I'd rather have regular jewelry, re regular gold jewelry, or silver, or white gold. So I think I have plenty of c costume jewelry. I do like this bangle because of the shape of it. It's more of an oval and I have very small wrists so it fits really nice. Uh, I do like this and it's just a magnetic closure and I like the earrings but I just don't need any more. <laughs> Another thing, I've got so many charms. So many charms and I do favor coach charms the most. This is all coach. I have a good amount over here that you can't see and I really don't need any more charms like I've got every color I've got cherries I've got I've got a lot of charms bag charms but I I'm not gonna say that one's not gonna pop up that I like that I might get but they they're not on my wish list I don't really need any more bag charms back to luxury I'm not going to be buying any more mini pochettes from Louis Vuitton. I'm not going to say that the Damier Azure print would make, make this a trifecta and I probably would use it, but I don't want to spend the money on little pouches with chains. <laughs> I have these, you know, I don't need any more mini pochettes. <laughs> I have two notebook covers from Coach and I love these. These are my, you know, my go-to notebooks. One, one of them, this one shows the sales that I've made and I'm a reseller. I also sell on Poshmark and Mercari if y'all didn't know that. The links are down below. But I keep track of my boutique sales as well. I also sell at a boutique. So this is very handy. I love the leather embroidered with the coach on the embroidery. It's super soft pebbled leather. This is really nice. And this is the vintage rose print. Also really nice. And I sometimes will write notes down in it. But honestly, I don't want any more notebook covers. <clears throat> so on to a bag. No more <laughs> little rhinestone purses. I've only worn this one time. I'm glad I got it. It's in pink for some special fun occasion. You know, it's cute. But I don't want any more little jeweled like rhinestone bags in my collection so no more of these this last one may irritate some people and i know that people love this style and maybe if i bought it in a smaller size i would love this style but honestly i don't think i am a bucket purse girl because I, I like the look of the bucket bag and everything. This one's just really big. And I never reach for this. I've worn it some, but it's been probably a year or two since I've actually worn this bag. I don't know if it bugs me that it's drawstring. I don't... <clears throat> I have a Louis Vuitton Petite Noé also. I'll pop a picture over here. And I hardly carry it, and it's a bucket bag. <laughs> so I have decided that even though they are beautiful, and I do really like this color, it's brown tomorrow, uh, I just don't think that the bucket style is for me. <laughs> so One more thing. No more pencil pouches. <laughs> I have three of the, of, I have two coach, and I have one Portland Leather Goods pouch, pencil pouch, or makeup or catch-all pouch. I don't need any more of these. <laughs> I can only use one per bag, and a lot of my bags do not fit 
this pencil pouch. So no more pencil pouches either. I think that wraps it up of my unwish list, not gonna buy. Now, if I end up buying one of these again, you can let me know. <laughs> but I'm really, I know my style, I know what I like. And having a channel like this on YouTube for a few years, you really get to know what kind of style you like, what kind of accessories you like. And I'm not going to say I'm never going to buy a charm again because I probably will. But that is definitely not on my wish list. I am going to use what I have of all of these great items and I will be happy with those items that I have. So I will tag some people down below of your unwish list and let me know if you're a subscriber to my channel and don't have a YouTube channel what is something that you own that you're not going to have on your wish list ever again let me know down below and thank you all for coming by and watching and subscribing it's free you know and don't forget to hit the bell so you won't miss my future videos and I want to thank you for stopping by and until next time i'll talk to you soon bye